Hi everyone! Today we are going on a visit to Leeds Castle in Kent, in Maidstone um, and they have really nice gardens and obviously a castle. Um, we came here when we were little but I can't really remember it that much so we'll see what it's like. At the moment we have to walk from the ticket office through um, like a woodlands area to get to the Castle Island so it's about a 10 minute walk so we're just going to be enjoying that for now. Castle was built in the 1100s. This is Leeds Castle in 13th century. You've got the castle and the bailey over there, and this is all the bailey. This is the main castle, and we're going to be entering through here. And we've just gone through the area where you get the audio guides, and we just found out a little bit about the third Lord Fairfax, who was also known as Black Tom. This is the heraldry room in Leeds Castle um, and it used to be called the Great Hall but Lady Bailey converted it into a library in 1927. This is a chapel in Leeds Castle it was built by Edward I on behalf of his wife, Eleanor of Bastille, who died. This is a bedchamber of Catherine of Aragon, King Henry VIII's first wife. It later became the bedchamber of Lady Bailey's husband, Sir Bailey. This is part of the moat for the castle, um, and it gets birds on it, and it's quite pretty. These are the Culpeco Gardens. We're going to go in the maze in Leeds Castle, see if we can find the way out. On the way out, if you manage to do it, we're going to go the grotto underground. So we're in the maze still and we're not doing too bad. Uh, we did go back on ourselves once. We just went, how are you finding it, Katie? Yes. She's finding it, yes. Yeah. Really says, hmm, and she's getting senses from Derek. <laughs> As Millie did. Oh, <laughs> we're really close. The exit is just there, but um we went round the wrong way and we got um, taken the loop, so we've got to go back. Okay, it's not as easy as we thought. We were really close to the centre, but we can't get in stuck. Because we are the champions of the maze. We did it, if you didn't get the hint. We did it, uh-uh, we did it, uh-uh. We're now going to go into the grotto underneath. It's like some kind of seaside grotto. Underground there's seashells and like seaside things and these are the Harris Hawks. We have Key Mac Brock and Texas. They don't fly um, weekdays in the winter, um, but they will when spring comes around. 
What's your name, Mr. Vulture? Here's Herman. a vulture called Herman. I'm leaving that in my vlog. Why not it wants to come out? This is the Dog Collar Museum. Um, I don't know much about dog. We're just in the cafe at the moment, having a bite to eat. Brunch. <laughs> What's lunch and dinner? Linner. We're having linner. Or pre-dinner. Yes, okay, it's pre dinner. Pre -dinner. Having dinner. Pre dinner. This is just the selection of the birds here at um, Leeds Castle. There's a white swan and two black swans. So we're on our way back to the car, um, and I thought I'd just tell you everything that I thought about Leeds Castle. Um, obviously, it's been really cold, um, like we're freezing, but it's been a good day out it's not been too busy but i think that's because of like the time of year we went um the castle there was a lot in the castle compared to some other places um there were quite a few rooms but a lot of them have been like redone by lady bailey and whatever um so there wasn't a lot of original stuff um and there wasn't a lot of information about the history of it all um the maze was good it's not a massive maze but it was really hard um we did get a a bit lost <laughs> um, there's a grotto underneath the maze and that is a bit um, it's nice but it's I think special um, I think if the birds of prey were flying today I think they'd be really good to go see um, and all the gardens and the trees and everything and the birds they're lovely to look at as well so it's beautiful so I'd say 7 out of 10 Millie what would you say 10 out of 10 Millie says 10 out of 10 Katie 3 8 out of 10 from Katie. So that's our Leeds Castle trip done. Thanks, guys. Bye.